channel I'm Jessica and I'm here with a brand new subscription service well to me at least I definitely was not planning on filming today but I came home and found this puppy in my mailbox now I know nobody is aware but I actually receive ipsy box subscriptions on a monthly or ipsy bag subscriptions monthly um, I just always can't honestly wait to film to open up my ipsy so I always open it every month and then forget to film a video after the fact with re with reviews and whatnot although they do sometimes the items make appearances in my um, fab five fab five weekly faves it's gonna be one of those days where I can't speak so this is for lip monthly this is a new subscription service that is specifically geared towards lip products and I thought how apropos that in all honesty this is what I wore and pardon the scissors in my hand I'm getting ready to dig in but um, I wore red lipstick to work today I wore Kat Von D's uh, everlasting love liquid lipstick in outlaw which is like a tomato we red and I kinda just went over it with a little bit of a chubby that I had to freshen it up later in the day um, but of course I'd have to open up a lip subscription service when I'm wearing red lips today so without further ado I'm cutting this baby open because I am curious as anything to see what is in here what you get now my understanding from watching other people do their subscriptions for lip monthly is that you get I think one full-size product so curious to see how that works out and right away I am uber impressed it actually comes in a makeup bag I didn't see that when other people did their openings um, or you know got into their bags for the lip monthly it actually has the lip monthly logo on it so you can see it says lip monthly it's got little pink lips it's in a really nice bright blue turquoise color so let's see what's inside and if you hear meowing somebody again couldn't wait to uh, Play with me when I got home there's a lot in here so you do get a little card that tells you what's in there um, it kind of tells you on the left a little bit of a note about this so August is a great month some are getting ready to go back to school others are enjoying the lovely weather outside and we received a lot of positive feedback about city color cosmetics products last month so we decided to include a new set of products again this month so let's see the first thing I'm going to go for is in a box um, it's actually by Pixie and call me crazy, but this is an eye product. Now this is called, like I said, lip monthly subscription service. As far as I know, you're only supposed to get lip, um, products, but this is really funny. Um, so Pixie is at Target. It's a brand I actually really, really like. Um, the products in all honesty, anything they say they do, they typically do with the ones that I own so far. And I've gotten this kind of stuff a few times in my ipsy this is the lid last shadow pen and it's water resistant this is in the color mink gilded mink and this is a color kind of pencil I've been looking for lately and I just can't seem to find anywhere it's well actually I've been looking for a frost this appears to be a matte but it's just a full on taupe color, like the kind of color that I wonder if that would even be good to do your eyebrows. Has a little bit of a sheen with the lights from the camera, but it's definitely not frosted. The next thing in here is from Jessie's Girl, which I happen to love a lot of Jessie's Girl's products. I just haven't seen this one. This is called Liquid Glass. It is a gloss, a lip gloss in pink. It's in the color Lip Lock, which is like a baby pink whoa that's like a true baby pink it's somewhat sheer but not really so you can kind of see that too that definitely has color the thing is I have really pigmented lips so I'm not sure how baby pink that's gonna come out on me and then I guess this is one of the first city color um, city color yeah city color lip products they're talking about this is the City Color B Matte Lipstick, which is, um, B Matte, I think is an entire line of products that they have. I just have to get the plastic off. This is in the color Phoebe, who is one of my favorite characters on Friends. Comes in nice little sleek packaging, but in all honesty, I mean, it's plastic. It does feel pretty cheap. It just kind of looks nice, and it came with plastic that is now static cling to my finger. Okay, so if we open this, you can see it's kind of, well, I don't know if you can see. 
but it's kind of like a really cool mauve color almost. And then it smells a little plasticky. Wow. It's actually not mauve at all. That is a bold pink, but it's like, um, it's a more neutral, cool tone, definitely. Like a more subdued, cool, cool toned, um, pink, but it's definitely got a bite to it. And these are matte, though that really did feel very creamy going on. And as far as prices on these things, so the Jessie's Girl was $4.99, the City Color Cosmetics B Matte was $3.99. And, oh, it's called a monthly mix-up when they put something in. So that monthly mix-up item, that lid last shadow pen from Pixie by Petra that you can get at Target, actually retails for $18. So, wow. The next item in here, also from City Color, and it looks like uh, the last two things in here are from City Color. Everything has that annoying plastic on it with the perforation, and you got to try and take it all off in one foul swoop or you'll be taking little pieces. So this is just called City Color Magic Bomb. It looks pink, but it's actually completely translucent pink looking. So it it really does look like a bomb. It's shaped like a lipstick. It has no scent, if anything a slight, very, very, very slight um, plasticky scent. And it actually has a subtle pink tint to it. The packaging kind of sucks though. It's pretty chubby the packaging. And, I mean, it's really a loose grip as far as the uh, lid connecting. I mean, it's a really cute shape, but it is pretty fat, and it scares me that it might open in my purse. And it's this color on the very end over here that definitely does feel very balmy, um, but it has kind of just a very subtle pink tone to it. And then the last item in the bag is also from City Color, and this is going to be one of those ones that's difficult to open because this is one of those ones where the plastic doesn't go to either end. It kind of just stops in the dang middle. I'm, I'm going to have little plastic shreds all over my desk when I'm done with this. So this is called City Color Lip Balm. So we had City Color Be Matte Lipstick. We had City Color Magic Balm. Now we have City Color Lip Balm. And this is in a color, this is in ultra pink. So I guess the theme of the month with lip colors is pink. They all definitely seem to be pink. This is more of like a neutral peachy pink it looks like, but let's see how it comes out if at all. Oh, this, this feels really balmy, but this has nice opaque color and it looks really creamy too. That feels really good going on. So that's the one that's horizontal across the bottom. And you can see that's more of a warm pink, kind of like a peachy pink. So that is my first experience with Lip Monthly. Lip Monthly was, um, I believe it's $10. I'll put all the information below because, to be honest, I signed up a month and a half ago and had to wait until this month for my box or my bag to ship out. Um, so I signed up quite some time, and I did so with a coupon code. Uh, so I know I got it for like half off. I want to say I paid $6 or $6.99 for this uh, box or bag. Um, but definitely, I mean, City Colors only a few dollars each. And just for price reference, those last two bombs, so the Chubby Magic Bomb, um, retails for, it's on here somewhere, $3.99. And then the Peach Lipstick that actually just rolled off my desk and onto the floor retails for $2.99. So, I mean, if I spent $6, you're looking at $5, uh, 9 14, 13, 13, 16, 16 plus that one magic or the monthly mix up item was 18 bucks. So you're looking at $34 and I spent $6 on this. So that's really not a bad deal. And I can vouch that that is how much these go for at Target. I will have the links to um, the products below if I can find this, them all on the City Color website as well as if this product is on Jessie's Girl. That way, if you're interested in the individual products, you'll know where to find them. I will also. Put down the uh, information for Lit Monthly below as well too. If you're interested, you can check it on out, see if they're still running a coupon code, but if I find one of those, of course I'll include it as well. That's all I have for you guys. Just really wanted to see what was in here and dig in. I was really excited and I definitely couldn't wait. Um, if you haven't done so already, please go ahead, hit the button below and subscribe. And if you like what you saw with this video and want to see more subscription services, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. I will see you all in my next video. Bye.